You've sliced that one, Captain. Straight for the bunker. Good. You're right, Aunt Sally. Yes, of course I was all right. Why shouldn't I be all right? Because that little titchy ball just clung to you on the head. It's entirely my business. Pardon? Dang me, Aunt Sally. That's another one. Yeah, you know what? I reckon there's someone nearabouts who knows that you're a genuine antiquity, Aunt Sally, and is tracking titchy balls at your end. Class will always tell. Yeah, yeah, I, I know that. But they shouldn't go around chucking balls willy-nilly, you know? They might have clunk poor old Wurzel. Yeah. What the blue blazers? It's my own ball! It's one jewel, one father. I'll wager anything you like it's that lunatic I had such trouble with on the first. You unmitigated bounder, sir! I'm gonna have words with you! Here, Aunt Sal. It's him again. That that cracked human who's always shouting and hollering and chasing after me. Oh, Russell, ain't he handsome? Handsome? He ain't handsome. How can he be handsome if he's off his chump? He's a toff! Toff? He's a bomb pot. He's always going round trying to knock down birds by hitting them with digi balls and a stick. Idiot! He ain't trying to knock anything down. He's a sporting gentleman. Mm. What you were doing, Aunt Oh, Russell, the merest glimpse at a sporting gentleman. Dear little heart goes pit a pat pit fit to bust. Where are you going? I'm just going to talk to him, of course. What about? Just pass the time of day and such. Yeah, but don't tell him I'm here. As if I would. Oh, good morning, ma'am. Uh, you haven't, I don't suppose, seen anything of an ugly, unkempt ruffian hanging around the green, have you? Oh, sir. I was hoping and praying some kind gentleman would come along and save me from his unwanted attentions. That's him hiding over there. You blackguard, sir! See him off, Rooney! Oh, thank you kindly, sir. Think nothing of it, ma'am. But if you want my advice, let this be a lesson to you and give up hanging around private golf club greens unescorted. Oh, I will indeed, sir. We'll call that one half further and proceed to the third. Oh, excuse me, sir. I was wondering if I might accompany you around the course in case that ignorant, smelly old scarecrow shows his horrible nose again. <laughs> I mean, that unwanted ruffian what looks like a ignorant, smelly scarecrow. Oh, well, you can carry for me if you like, ma'am. 